Could Scarlet Witch be the villain of Doctor Strange Into the Multiverse of Madness? Marvel Studios has been dabbling with the idea of an alternate universe and dimensions for a while. The multiverse was introduced in the Thor films and was explored in more depth in Doctor Strange and the Ant-Man movies. The MCU traditionally uses the term multiverse to refer to the idea of other planes of existence, such as the quantum realm. Doctor Strange even went a step further on his magical mystery tour, in which Stephen Strange's astral form was blasted across the multiverse by the Ancient One, easily one of the trippiest scenes in the MCU to date. Avengers Endgame further developed this concept, revealing that the multiverse also included alternate realities where history has progressed in different ways. This will be the key to at least two of Disney Plus TV shows, Loki and What If. The title of Doctor Strange 2 strongly suggests that the multiverse is going to take center stage in the MCU as well. Meanwhile, Benedict Cumberbatch will be joined by an unexpected guest star, Elizabeth Olsen's Scarlet Witch. The two have fought alongside one another in the recent past, but Scarlet Witch could be the villain rather than an ally in the multiverse of madness. Scarlet Witch's vast power came at a terrible cost, as Doctor Strange noted in Avengers number 503. Wanda possessed abilities that she had neither earned nor understood. Can you understand the delicate mindset of a woman, a person who has control over reality, he asked the Avengers. It means reality controls her. Imagination becomes the enemy. Every day Wanda faced the temptation to wish away anything bad that happened to her, and in every time she did that, her grip on reality itself began to slip away. At its most dramatic, this manifested in Wanda's desire to have children. The Avengers were understandably more than a little surprised when Scarlet Witch became pregnant with twins. The father, Vision, was an android who was incapable of reproduction. Wanda gave birth, but tragically the Avengers learned that the two infants never really existed at all. They were an illusion created by Wanda's mind. The Avengers erased all memories of the babies, hoping that this would allow her to recover. But Scarlet Witch was a powder keg, and all it took was an unwary comment from Wasp to light the match. She remembered her children and suffered a complete nervous breakdown. This led to the shocking events of Avengers Disassemble, where reality itself became the Avengers' greatest enemy, tearing them apart. Significantly, Elizabeth Olsen herself has said that this arc, which led to the House of M story, is one that she'd love to see on the big screen. Could Doctor Strange 2 present her with the chance to see her hopes fulfilled? There's a good chance that Scarlet Witch will become the villain of Doctor Strange 2. The MCU's version of Wanda Maximoff isn't quite the same character as in the comics, and so her powers are a little bit different. However, it's noted that Marvel Studios appears to be prepping Scarlet Witch for a sorcerer. The MCU introduced its version of magic in the first Doctor Strange in a speech from the Ancient One. She described magic as the source code that shapes reality and explained that the masters of the mystical arts harness energy drawn from other dimensions of the multiverse to cast spells, conjure shields, and weapons to make magic. In an interview back in 2016, Marvel Studios president Kevin Feige suggested that Scarlet Witch's abilities operate in the same way. It's not all that difficult to imagine the MCU Scarlet Witch suffering from some kind of nervous breakdown, and as a result unlocking depths of her powers that she's never wielded before. The MCU has always stressed that there's a connection between Wanda's powers and her mental state. When Quicksilver died in Avengers Age of Ultron, she let out a keen rage and grief that was accompanied by a devastating burst. When she took on Thanos single-handedly in Avengers Endgame, she was still fresh from Vision's death. Over the course of Phase 2 and 3, Wanda Maximoff has lost everything she loves, and it would hardly be surprising to see her mind begin to crumble. This leads us to one of the strongest aspects of Marvel's Phase 4 plans. Marvel Studios is releasing WandaVision right before Doctor Strange 2, a TV series on Disney Plus that will feature the unexplained return of Vision. The events of that series currently are a mystery, but Marvel Studios has confirmed that WandaVision leads into Doctor Strange 2. It could be that, just as in the comics, Wanda's expanding power set and mental instability have led her to create a tragic reality in which she gets the family she's dreamed of over the course of the show, Scarlet Witch could begin to question this reality and realize her mind is breaking down. That would perfectly position her to go to the Sorcerer Supreme and become a key player, perhaps even ultimately the villain in Doctor Strange into the Multiverse of Madness.